right, folks, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, it is now time for the most epic debut of all time. Yes, today is the fourth, so of course, we're, over the next few little while, we're going to be giving you guys a few matches to get you guys ready for our upcoming 2022 season. We'll have the announcer for the day announce the people if he can. So the Red Dragon's on the way to the ring. Bobby Fish and Kyle Riley's got that pot right as well. Of course, all elite they are. Former WWE superstars. Here at the Monster Mania Arena. And happen to notice where this is taking place today. Should be an interesting contest as two former rivals putting aside their differences. And finally, there's an old saying sometimes, folks. If you can't beat them, you might as well join them. So, two of the most dangerous minds together coming together. Both power of darkness and the power of light. Coming together as one. And this should be an interesting debut of sorts. To see how well they work together as a team. As there goes the lights. A lot of <laughs> speculation, rumors, and whatnot. Lights are out. As we await the rival, and yes, there he is, is Father Evil, ladies and gentlemen, and accompanied by... No, your eyes are not deceiving you. That is Cosplay Jesus. These two former rivals, all of 2021, fought back and forth. Power of dark, the power of darkness and the power of light fought and fought all of 2022, 21 rather. And since have reached a pact. So, yes, Father Evil and Cosplay Jesus seem to be on the same page. They're really interested to see how they work as a functioning team, however. As you see, it is Cosplay Jesus. There's a certain darkness runs over this crowd, a certain hush over the audience in all honesty uh, teams like the Adele boys the current dream masters BA tag team champions need to pay attention to this because down the road eventually they're going to be having to defend I would imagine against this these types of teams and how do you compete with people who can do this kind of stuff and there they go Fish and O'Reilly got the right idea. <laughs> I don't blame them. Get out of Dodge. What is this now? Oh boy. The cosplay. Jesus raising hell, literally. Both individuals showing off their powers. The darkness and the light. Kyle O'Reilly looks like he's starting things off against cosplay Jesus. In our opening contest today, not a huge card today, only four matches. As I said, over the next course of the next couple, we're going to show you guys a sample of what you can look forward to coming on the days which we're going to be in action. Mondays, Tuesdays, Wednesdays, <laughs> Thursdays, and Fridays. Five days? Probably more like Mondays, Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Fridays, but sure enough, we'll be here along with our Women Warriors Erection, uh, Women Warriors of Wrestling, as Cosplay Jesus. Right now, being very aggressive. And it has been a little while since we've seen Cosplay Jesus in action, but he does seem to have a little extra oomph today. He and longtime rival, oh my, oof. Ian, ow. Cosplay Jesus lighting up Kyle O'Reilly. Down he goes. They fought all of 2021, Cosplay Jesus and Father Evil. Now seeming to be on the same page. Ouch. 
Kyle O'Reilly, who is trained in multiple forms of martial arts, right now is getting manhandled right now by Cosby. This is a tag. Now we're going to see some of that tag offense. Uh oh, watch out. Elbow to the back. Ooh, Father Evil spitting that ass, that whatever that is, in the face and a kick to the face. Interesting. And a cover. Getting a whole two count over that one. Father Evil ooh, buries a foot into the gut with Kyle O'Reilly. If you're Bobby Fish, do you even want to get in the ring? Ouch. Other evil laying down the law, so to speak, and Kyle O'Reilly crawling on his hands and knees to his corner. Looks like Father Evil is going to allow him to make the tag to Bobby Fish, who uh, Father Evil is waiting for him. Gets a foot, which normally would put down most people. There's a look, look at the speed for a guy the size of Father Evil. That is a dangerous thing for someone to comprehend. Tag to cosplay Jesus in. It seems to be working pretty well here. Oh, Kyle O'Reilly might have been, I mean, sorry, Bobby Fish might have been waiting for that. There's a spine buster. That is the first real sign of offense that these guys really started with. Fish came in with a foot to Father Evil. Didn't do a hell of a lot. And now Cosplay Jesus taken back over in a quick cover. Getting a one count here at the Monster Mania Arena. Uh-oh. Watch out. Father Nelson suplex right there. Uh oh. Now with his fingers down the gullet of Bobby Fish. Are you trying to. Is that a mandible claw? Fish look. Ouch. Into the cover. He's in enemy territory. I guess Kyle O'Reilly had the, had confidence that Bobby Fish was going to be tough enough to kick out of that. And now, Cosplay Jesus sending Fish to the corner. Tag. Uh-oh, they're going to end this. Here it comes. The Lightness Dark... They call, they call that the Battle of Souls. And that was going to be it right there. Uh-oh. Cosplay Jesus has got Bobby Fish by the gullet. That's it. Bobby Fish is out. Wow, what a dominating performance. And the tag team division here on Fridays has just been put on notice. Watch this. When Cosplay Jesus and Father Evil are on the same page, that is a bad deal. And a team like Fish and O'Reilly, who are a bona fide, two of the probably the toughest guys of any locker room, were just dominated by a team the caliber of Father Evil and Cosplay Jesus, who are on the same page. The tag team division, like I said, better pay attention to this. This is something the Odell boys on Fridays need to pay attention to. Here are your winners, the Ministry. And the Ministry, the team of... Father Evil and Cosplay Jesus seemingly on the same side. Look at those cold eyes. And even Cosplay Jesus seems to have the eyes. Oof. Goodness me. 